Hey guys, Mike Mouse 74 with a video review of Transformers Universe Darkwind, who is just a repaint of Transformers Universe Silverbolt. I'll give you guys a full 360 to show you guys what he's like all around, and then I'll bring in um, Silverbolt to give you guys a quick comparison between the two. Um, Darkwind is now a Decepticon instead of an Autobot. He is a Concord Jet. It looks pretty cool. Um, I got him at Toys R Us at one of my hauls from the U.S. If you guys remember one of my videos that I did. And plus I saw Skybeat01's video, so I, I thought I'd do the review. So it looked kind of cool since I haven't done this review yet. So I wanted to share this with you guys. So I'll bring in the comparison with Transformers Universe Silverbolt to show you guys the comparison uh, between the two. So you can tell, obviously tell the, uh, the color difference. One's a uh, darker gray, one's more of a lighter gray. Um, for Darkwind, his missile is blue. And for Silverbolt, it's, his missile is uh, red. And for the gun on uh, Darkwind, it's uh, dark gray. And for Silverbolt, it's a black color. And just so you guys know, I will be transforming them both into uh, robot mode and then back into their Concord jet mode. But just because they're really, really simple to transform. So you guys are getting two reviews in one. And if you look in the back, I'll give you guys a close up for you. You can see the uh, the rocket boosters on Silverbolt. It's a blue, whereas on uh, Darkwind, it is a purple color. And same with the landing gear on Silverbolt, it's red. And on Darkwind, it's a blue color, if you guys can see right there and there. So I just want to give you guys a little bit of detail with that. So I'll just take Silver Bolt off for a few minutes and then give you guys a little bit more detail. So you can see he has a Decepticon symbol on top of the uh, airplane, on top of the cockpit. And it has purple translucent windows. And then if you look on, if you see here, there's a button and on the back, they do light up. And it just makes a firing noise. And these do light up as well, right here and right there as, as well. They do light up if you just press the button back here. So you can, you can hold that as long as you want, it'll still fire. It makes another noise as well. So to go ahead and transform uh, Dark Wind, you just take the, the missile off and just kind of put it down the side. Uh, what I always like to do, uh, I always do last, but I keep forgetting, so just fold the landing gear in first. Make sure you do that on anything, on any of the transformers that have wheels and whatnot, so make sure they're, they're tucked in. Um, and then you want to take the, the cone, the nose cone of uh, Darkwind. If you guys can see, there's a, uh, there's a hole right in there. And there's a, I don't, I don't know if you guys want to call it a peg, but you just kind of put that in right in there like that and just snap it in. And then for his legs, you want to, actually for his arms, just bring, bring out his arms first and then bring them to the side, get them out of the way. And then, uh, you want to bring down the legs, bring them down like so, and then make sure that the silver part on Darkwind is facing towards you, and then just lift out his foot, and then bring out his heel, which isn't much, his heel is right here, just bring it out like that, that's all there is to it for that. Do the same thing with the other at the leg, you want to bring that down, and then make sure the silver part, his, his kneecap is facing towards you, and then lift out his, heel, his foot, and then again, lift his heel out just a tad, which is not too much. And then we bring the camera up a little bit. Um, for his head, you just want to press down together, like so. When you do that, it makes a transformation noise, and his uh, eyes do light up a red color. For his arms, you want to bring out his hands, like so. And just make sure you just snap that in place. And then do the same thing with the other side. You want to just do, bring out his arm, or it's his fist, and just snap it in there like that, and then just kind of rotate it. And then there you have Darkwind in his robot mode, and then just put his gun in his in his fist like that, and whatnot. 
So I'm just gonna put Dark Wind uh, on the stand. And then I'll, uh, I'll put uh, Silverbolt in his robot mode. So this, again, it's the same, the same transformation. Um, fold in the landing gear first, like so, and then like so, and then like that. And then uh, next, you want to just take the, the the front of the airplane and lift it up. There's a peg on top of silver bolt here. You guys can see that. And then there's a, there's a hole right there. You just want to take it and then just kind of slide it right there and then peg it in there. And then you want to take silver bolt's arm and just kind of lift it out out of the way. And then take his legs and just bring them down. Like so, and then rotate it so the silver part or the uh, the gold part is facing towards you. Do the same thing with the other leg, and make sure the uh, the gold part is facing you. And then just bring out his feet, and then his his heel, which is, isn't much, but just gives him the stability to stand. Bring out his other foot, and then just bring out slightly his other heel. And then you just want to collapse um, collapse these together. And it makes the transformation noise, and instead of his eyes lighting red, his turn it lights up green. For his fist, you just kind of bring out his fist like so, and then do the same thing with his other fist. So I apologize, my clock going off. Do the same thing with his other fist, just like so, and then you just kind of want to rotate it, and then just kind of rotate it so you want to get that like that, and then you can. Put his gun in here, like so. And then I'll just turn this around and I'll put Silver Bolt in the back and I'll show you guys a quick comparison with both figures as well. So overall, pretty cool figures. I'll give you guys a close up. And then you can see the Decepticon symbol on uh, Darkwind's chest right there. And I'll spin him around and just uh, give you guys a comparison with, with uh, Silver Bolt. So you can see the comparison with both figures. And then he has, Silver Bolt has a Autobot symbol on the center of his chest right there. So you guys, like I said, you guys are getting two reviews in one, just because they're really, really simple to transform. That's why I'm doing this. <clears throat> so let me just take Silver Bolt out of the way and I'll give you guys a full 360 of just um, Dark Wind. And then I'll put uh, Dark Wind back in his um, Concord jet mode. So he is a pretty cool figure. I mean, I like the repaints. You know, they're, they're coming out a lot better, and a little bit more detail as well in, in the in the figure. Oops. <laughs> 
Oh, sorry about that. And I'll give you guys one more 360. And then I'll put him back in his Concord jet mode for you guys. And same with the Silver Bolt. So to go ahead and put Darkwin in his Concord mode, just get rid of the, uh, the, the gun. Um, you want to just put the feet up and bring, or put the feet down rather, sorry. And then just kind of rotate them, kind of get him ready. Um, for his arms or his fist, you just tuck his fist inside. Whoops, sorry, it was like, the, I was off cam. So it was out like this, you just want to tuck it in just like that and kind of get them out of the way, kind of lift them up. And you want to rotate it just so that the peg is facing out like that and do the same thing with the other one. The other, the other hand, you just want to push it in like so and then just kind of get the hand up out of the way. And then you want to bring down the, the waist area. When you do that, it makes the transformation noise like so. And then you want to tuck Darkwind's leg. There's a, a groove right in here. You want to put the legs in the groove. Oops. Just like, if I can show you guys. Just like that. And then you want to do the same thing with the other leg. You want to bring it up and put it in the groove right there as well. Just like like that and kind of pinch them together so it's nice and tight. And then if you guys can see, there's a hole right there and a peg right there. And you just want to, you want to put that peg in that hole or that peg in a hole like that. Do the same thing with the other side. There's a hole right in there. And then you just want to peg that in there if, you, if, if I can do this for you guys. Just like, like that. And then next you want to bring down the, the, uh, the front end of the Concorde, just like that. And then bring, finally bring down the, uh, the landing gear. Well, not finally, but bring out the landing gear like so. And then you want to put the gun in here. Like there's a hole and there's a peg and just squeeze it in there like that. And then there you have Darkwind back in his, whoops, bring that up like that. And there you have Darkwind back in his Concord mode. And then do the same thing with Silver Bolt. You wanna just take the gun out, flip the hands in like so. You wanna flip the other hand in like that and kind of get him, get it ready. Bring them out to the side, like so. And then you want to bring the feet up, or bring the feet down, sorry, bring the feet down. Kind of rotate it and kind of get everything ready. And then you want to kind of bring down the, the waist area, like so, and it makes the transformation noise. And again, there's a groove and on both sides here. You want to just tuck that in there like that. And again, with the other side, there's a groove right in there, so you want to tuck that in here. Like so, and kind of just pinch them together, like so, so they're nice and tight. And then for his arms, you want to just bring down, again, the same thing, there's a hole right in there. And then there's a peg on silver bolt right there. So you just want to peg that in there, just like, like that, you do the same thing on the other side. There's a hole right there. And then there's a peg, if you guys can see, right there. And you just want to peg that in there, just like, just like, if I can get it, like that. And then you want to bring down the, the nose cone of silver bolt and just kind of peg it in there. And then uh, you want to bring down the landing gear, like so. Make, make sure they're pinched together and then bring out the landing gear. And then finally just put the gun in, in here like so. And then there you guys have both Darkwind and 
Silverbolt back in their Concord jet mode. And I'll give you guys one more 360 so you can see how awesome they really are. So this has been a video review of both, actually both Darkwind and Silverbolt because I wanted to show you the, the, uh, the difference in the two figures and the, uh, the comparison and whatnot. So this is Mighty Mouse signing off. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, support the mouse, support our Transformer community. And uh, I'll catch you guys later. Take care, guys.